son was shot in his house. And as he seeks justice, he can't find it. And he can't find it because he doesn't feel like he's getting the help that he needs from the police. It needs to stop now. And it has to stop now. I am so sick and so tired of coming into this building day after day and year after year and watching as people that look like me know that our lives simply do not matter. If they do not matter, if they do not matter, then we are nothing. And I'm telling you right now, we are far from nothing. because I was kind of upset, but I'm going to tell y'all something. I don't believe in God, and, and that's not, that, that's just me. But I'm not saying nothing about y'all who believe in it. And I'm not going to come into church and try to stop it. If that's what you believe in, that's good. But I'm telling you, we are, we are tired. And you know what I'm saying? We are tired. I mean, and we keep coming up under the guideline. Look when we down here. On the side, right. when the time, when the city shut down, we always up under the umbrella. When we gonna step out and get wet? <laughs> My grandson been gunned down in a house, seven years old. The news media had it on for three days. But when somebody get killed in five points in the vista, it's like they're making a new record. <laughs> but I'm trying to figure out what it's gonna take. We have nothing but women here. We have some men. But it's time for us to stand up. Yeah. And be men to your turn. Yeah. Don't be their friend. I smoked and crack. I did have a run. Yeah. My mama didn't do it. She was ready to kill me. Now the church smoking reefer. You smoking it with them. But how are we going to take it? Yeah. Everybody get on TV and call us Amber. The drips, the blood, I never disrespect that woman. And I know they do some bad things. Conditioned. We got to be conditioned back to be what we're supposed to be. Right. We don't lost our guidelines. And I'm telling y'all, I'm tired of talking to our kids. They got mine. I can do like the rest of the politicians do. Live in the house up on the hill so I can buy one. But I'm telling y'all, I love it. I'm not like the song. I'm not like the song. I ain't going back to you niggas. I love y'all. And when you see me, I'm not out to hurt you. I'm coming to help you. I ain't gonna even stop. So I'm telling y'all, if we don't change our kids, because you see what the coronavirus do. It's killing the head, so you know what the back, the back gonna do. It's gonna die too, cause we don't know nothing. So y'all come and get yourself together. All these politicians, they keep saying about vote. We got everybody we need in the right places. 
We got Steve Benjamin. See, I like calling names. We got Simpson, Daryl Jackson, and over the church. But they don't come to us when we need them. We got to go to him and pay our tithes. We tired of that. If you believe in God, that's a good thing. But you're going to have to put it aside because we need you today, not tomorrow. We, hold on, we plead for We're not going to. We need everyone to clear out the way. We're going back to our program, and then everybody will have a chance to speak and express. But one of the things I don't see up here on these steps, I see a bunch of gaps. Can I get, can we come up on these steps, please? Can we cross the barricade, please? Can we cross the barricade, please? Can we get on the steps, please? Let's show them, because the media is down there, and they can't see us when our backs is turned to them. We need to be up here so they can see our faces. Yeah, well,